Hey, what's going on, phone dogs? Bo HD here. Hope you guys are doing well. Now, we have rounded up an assortment of tech that is sure to tickle your fancy. Earphones, headphones, smart journals, wireless charging enabled battery packs, that's just the beginning. Sit back, relax, and let us show you some cool new tech. First, we have Marshall's new mid-active noise cancellation equipped headphones. The company behind some of the most recognized music amplifiers in the market has released a really good looking and sounding pair of headphones. In the looks department, they feature a plush headband wrapped in soft microfiber with some gold highlights in the form of a Marshall logo and uh, a little joystick navigation button. There's a lot of flex, they're not too heavy or bulky, and they block out a lot of sound for being on-ear headphones as opposed to over-ear cans. My only complaint is that the ear cups don't swivel in and fold flat when storing them, but they do fold inwards, which uh, is better than nothing. Also, the joystick for controlling music playback can be a little bit hard to get used to and learn the controls when you're wearing them. It's clean and minimal, but doesn't function as well as separate buttons. Now you have Bluetooth APTX technology that keeps the wireless signal strong up to 30 feet with no noticeable audio quality impairment, What's neat about this particular pair is that they feature active noise cancellation to drown out much of your background noise. You can buy a pair without this capability, but it's absolutely worth it. I think it's worth the extra uh, 50 bucks or so. I'm pretty used to listening to music via high quality headphones, so I tested them out with a $100 pair of headphones and immediately appreciated just how rich and detailed the Marshall sound was. The bass is robust without being too overpowering. You factor in the 20 hour battery life and you have a great all around pair of headphones. Links below to check them out. Now I like all in one devices and one of the most unusual but surprisingly appreciated all in one device I had the pleasure of testing last month was the Tesmo Universe Book. This is the world's first fast wireless charger power bank and journal in one. The journal itself is constructed with bi-cast leather that has a soft, minorly grippy texture to it that looks very elegant. On the front is an embossed solar system design that marks where the 10 watt fast charger lies. So if you rest your iPhone 10 or other wireless charging enabled device on this spot, it will start charging. Inside you have a number of pockets for business cards, bills, uh, various documents and there's a six ring binder with a daily planner that can help you keep track of your projects, to-do lists, there's calendar events, there's a lot of stuff you can write down here. The fun doesn't stop there though. The back page features a USB-A, lightning, USB-C, and micro USB charging cable for charging up all of your devices. We also have a pen or pencil holder and a battery indicator. This indicator will let you know how much power is left in the internal 8,000 milliamp hour power bank. The only catch with this product is that it's a Kickstarter product, so it can be purchased for an early bird price of $59. That's $70 off the expected retail price of $129, but it might not arrive as soon as two-day shipping via Amazon. JB's sent us their new Firefly wireless earbuds to check out before they actually go on sale. These are fully wireless earbuds that sit independently in your ears. They're made of plastic, so they shouldn't weigh down your ears and make them sore after listening to music for long periods of time. And they're incredibly smooth, allowing them to fit comfortably. It's important to keep in mind that they form a tight seal in your ears, so don't expect to be able to hear much around you. But with that said, they do have a feature that will let you filter the background noise back through your ears if that's what you want to do. Music quality does become noticeably worse though when you have this feature enabled. A single touch will activate the Google Assistant or Siri, depending on the device that's uh, paired with it. There is Bluetooth 5.0 technology to help improve signal strength, but I did notice that it's not perfect. Uh, I did notice a few audio hiccups in my testing when moving more than 15 to 30 feet away. Sound quality also isn't revolutionary, but it's solid given the overall size of these earbuds. You can expect some tinniness, um, but there's clear bass and a fairly uh, balanced sound. For $99, the Firefly wireless earbuds aren't an instant buy, but they could be worth purchasing if you're looking for in-ear headphones or earphones that stay firmly planted in your ears when working out. Now I wanna turn the spotlight over to some really useful accessories that keep with our unintended but totally awesome wireless theme we have with this video. 
The IATI ION Wireless Plus charging pad does one thing really well, and that's a wirelessly charge your compatible smartphone. It uses USB-C as an input, so you don't have to keep using the old micro USB standard that many wireless chargers still employ, and it features a USB port for charging another device of yours. The cloth texture also helps keep your device scratch-free and stylish on a desk or nightstand. The biggest con is its relatively steep $40 to $50 price, but I'll include the lowest price I can find in the description below. The other IATI product is the Easy One Touch 4 Dash and Windshield Mount for your smartphone that securely holds your phone in your car. The telescopic arm can help you position the phone just right. The locking side arms also open up and close to keep your phone held securely or, you know, to help you easily pop it out. This mount retails for about $30. The last product we have for you today is RAV Power's new 10,000 milliamp hour battery charger with support for wireless charging. So not only can you fast charge a device via the iSmart 2.0 USB port, but you can set a Qi compatible device on top of the charger to actually charge it up. No strings or wires attached. Since I recently switched back to the iPhone 10, this little battery pack is gonna be my new daily driver. It's going right in my backpack straight after this video. Just like the previous product, it's about $30 on Amazon. So I'll go ahead and place a link to check it out as well as everything else mentioned in this video. With that last one, those are the best tech devices we had the pleasure of testing out during the month of July, 2018. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. This is one of my favorite series, so I really hope you enjoy it. If you'd like to see any one particular device featured in an episode, let us know what it might be in a comment down below. I'm Bo HD from PhoneDog.com. Thanks for watching, and I will see you right back here in the next one. See ya.